Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's request for a different home was reportedly firmly denied. The couple, who now live in an £11 million mansion in Montecito, previously resided in Frogmore Cottage on the Windsor Estate. This historic cottage was a wedding gift from the late Queen. However, it seems they initially had their sights set on Windsor Castle itself, but this request was turned down by the Queen. The Queen reportedly politely but firmly suggested that Harry and Meghan live in Frogmore Cottage, instead, according to royal author Hugo Vickers. Everyone is saying the same thing about Zara Tyndall's latest outfit on Australia trip, he told The Times. There are empty bedrooms and suites in the private apartments which the Sussexes may have had their eye on, or perhaps some former living quarters in the castle grounds converted into other things. But I can see how it might not be entirely appropriate to have a young family living there. Before they moved into Frogmore Cottage, several other Windsor homes were considered for Harry and Meghan. One of these was Adelaide Cottage, now home to Prince William, Kate and their children, who moved there from London in 2022. Property expert Jonathan Rowland has warned that if Harry and Meghan are considering moving, now could be the time to sell. Don't miss! Meghan desperate for fashion endorsement after Dior snub, author claims Prince Harry cut ties with close pal after he said too much during interview, details, Meghan's attempt at making lots of money in new role has failed, expert, insight. Peeking to the mirror, he said, one reason Harry and Meghan might be looking to move is to take advantage of the reported rise in value their mansion has accrued. He explained that their home's value could have increased by over £10 million since they moved in. However, he cautioned, but, like here, property markets in the US can rapidly change, so they might think this is the time to make their move and cash in. The Sussex's current home has 9 bedrooms and 16 bathrooms, plus fun extras like a games room, gym, tennis courts, and even a tea house. Jonathan mentioned another big draw. As well as obviously being a stunning property, the home also comes with the wow factor of once being owned by Harry and Meghan. For many this will be a huge selling point and can, itself, add to the value, he said. For all the latest on news, politics, sports, and showbiz from the USA, go to Daily Express US become an Express Premium member support fearless journalism read the Daily Express online advert free get super fast page loading start 30 day free trial